Hey all my hair enthusiasts, TJ Rosbeck here, independent hair designer, a stylist for you 24-7, and ask expert with Schwarzkopf Professional. Here is my video submission to be a part of the 2020 guest artistic team with Schwarzkopf Professional. Let's go play in some hair. Now on Emily, we did a fabulous fall color. She was looking to add dimension, brighten up her natural color, but still keep it low maintenance. So what we did was we pre-lined her hair using a balayage and baby light technique using our Blonde Me Bond Enforcing Premium Lightener 9 Plus with the 2% 7 volume Blonde Me Oil Developer. After that, we did a root smudge using the Agora Vibrance 5-1, that's a level 5 Sandre, with the 1.9% 6 volume lotion activator. And then to create that dimension through the mid strands and ends, we used the Agora Royale Pearl Essence Pastel Toners 9.5-89, that's red violet, mixed with a little bit of the Agora Royale 9-98, that's a level 9 violet red, with the 3% 10 volume Agora Royale Premium Developer. So we are finished with the color, we're going to go into the haircut here. For Emily, we're going to do a nice angled lob. So first I'm going to bring everything down zero degrees, do a blunt cut, and then from the occipital up, I'm going to bring the layers out to 45 degrees to create a nice bevel shape with an angled forward. <laughs> After shampooing Emily's color with our BC Bonicure 4.5 Color Free Shampoo and Conditioner, we brought her back to the chair to prep her with our BC Bonicure Hyaluronic Moisture Kick Leave-In Conditioning Spray. It's great to bring in moisture and detangle the hair. And for styling, we prepped the hair with the Volumizing Osis Plus Grip Mousse, cocktailed with the BC Bonicure Hyaluronic BB Hydro Pearl. <laughs> And then before curling, we were using the Osis Plus Session Label Smooth Strong Hairspray. It's a great build bow product, use little, use a lot. And then for finishing, we used the Osis Plus Session Label Texture Spray to give her hair that great second day dirty feel. Yeah. 